Pope Francis has been leading a mass at St. Peter's Basilica in the Vatican for Easter Sunday. The 86-year-old expressed his deep concern about the escalating tensions between Israelis and Palestinians and called on the international community to end the war in Ukraine. From Vatican City, our religion editor Ali McBull reports. From the early hours, they streamed into St. Peter's Square for Easter Mass. People had come from all over the world, but just days ago, there had been doubts about whether the Pope would be well enough to take part in events at all. Some here told of their relief when he appeared, but there was still nervousness as to how strong he really was after his bout of bronchitis. Once the service got underway, Pope Francis seemed untroubled. But it was once the mass was over that he appeared most relaxed. Though for the first time he'd missed one event on Good Friday, he'd now successfully negotiated the rest of the toughest week in his calendar. Well, there have been moments in the week during services when the Pope has seemed a little breathless, a little weak even. But every time he's been in the crowds and interacted with people, he's really appeared to be much more energised. He looked in really good health, you know, the, the crowd, I'm sure, were, no, were uh, encouraging him along, but he looked very healthy, you know, happy um, and doing, doing his job very well. But you know, it was great to see him in, in fine spirits. I was very worried when he was in hospital and I kept informed because he's so special. He wanted to fulfil all his commitments for this Holy Week and to see him here, you realise how strong he is. Pope Francis ended events with an appearance on the balcony of St. Peter's Basilica to deliver his Urbi et Orbi, a blessing to the city and the world. Ali McBall, BBC News, in Vatican City.